Hello crime fighters, I'm Ray the DA and this is Straight Talk. Well this is part three of our cost of crime to Kentucky victims. This episode will deal with the cost of crime to victims in the year 2012. In part two you'll remember we learned how the authors of the study victim costs and consequences a new look we're able to determine a far more accurate formula to reflect the real costs of crime suffered by crime victims their results allowed us to apply their formula to the part one or serious crimes committed in Kentucky during 2012 as reported by the Kentucky State Police their exhaustive two-year study was completed in 1996 and the dollar figures were based on the value of the dollar in that year 1996 and when we apply the the cost per crime formula to the number of serious crimes committed in Kentucky in 2012 the real cost of crime to Kentucky victims when adjusted for inflation and the value of the dollar in 2012, the actual cost of crime in 2012 was, get this, a whopping $1.564 billion. Now you can see on the screen. Now let's compare the cost of crime, that $1.56 billion in 2012 which the victims somehow have to absorb or pay for, to the cost to incarcerate people who commit those crimes in 2012. Well, we looked at the, the Department of Corrections figures, and guess what? The cost to incarcerate or put in prison and jail the criminals doesn't really capture the seriousness of the issue. It focuses only on dollars and cents. So the term itself, the cost of incarceration, is so antiseptic that it becomes meaningless. A better term in my mind and in the minds of many victims is what's the cost to protect citizens from crime and criminals? So what did our state spend to protect our citizens from criminals in 2012? I'll tell you what it was. $411 million. $411 million. Think about that, crime fighters. The cost, innocent law-abiding, tax-paying Kentucky crime victims suffered at the hands of criminals, mostly repeat offenders in 2012, was almost four times the amount that our Kentucky government was willing to spend to protect us from those hoodlums. Yes, sir, the criminals are winning and it's high time we change that. Public safety, after all, is very important to Kentucky citizens and that's what we want our tax money spent on. I'm Ray the DA and this is Straight Talk.